Coming up on Pick a Puppy. After a tragic house fire, Kian and Mike are looking for a perfect puppy to symbolize a fresh new start in their life. But is their dog Alice ready for a little brother or sister? Hi everyone, I'm Beverly Mahood. Now today on Pick a Puppy, we're meeting with Mike and Kian. They're considering three very active breeds, the Weimaraner, the English Springer Spaniel, and the Doberman Pinscher. So let's see which puppy they choose. All right, boys, well, it's good to finally meet you. Good to meet you. You guys seem excited about all this. Well, we are. Yeah, a little nervous, but yeah, yeah absolutely. Yeah. But a learning experience, to say the least, yeah. Well, you guys have big hearts because you have Alice. Tell me yeah. all about Alice. Alice is fantastic. Awesome. She's a German short hair pointer. I lovely. got her live and found her, and she found me, is what I basically say. And yeah. I'm so glad she came into my life. An She's an immediate so friend. You know, we connected right away. So they're loyal. They stick right by your side. They're very, very high energy, which is something that I personally look for in a dog. That's so it's great. both you guys are the caregivers for Alice. Yes. Hey, okay. yeah. and I'm it's dual at this yeah. point now, for sure. So whose idea is it to get another dog? Uh, more mics, yeah. I would say, yeah. I, I wanted a dog for a long, long time now, and uh, I just thought after all this kind of stuff that had happened, it's, it's nice to turn over a new page. So do you guys mind sharing a bit of that turmoil? With us? Uh, not at all, sure. not at all. I guess three months ago, Alice and I, we went into the uh, cottage, and I got a phone call saying that uh, my apartment was on fire. What does that feel like? I mean, I... It's horrible. I lost everything. I had clothes on my back. But, you know, it was like a major spring house cleaning. Just a little excessive, that's all. It was a very strange day. Like, yeah. I, I was at work and I... We went online and watched it online. So it was just really hard to watch all that going on and being so helpless. So I was very thankful that they'd gone up to the cottage that day. Um, or it could have been a lot worse. Could have been a lot worse. Yeah. And I'm glad that Alice was there. At least she uh, gave me my puppy love that I needed to get through it. And even to this day, I still haven't uh, been able to gain access to the place. So I don't know what's there, what's not. And in the meantime, I've got uh, great family and friends, as I said. And I got this young whippersnapper to keep me happy and sweet, sweet Alice. And that's why we're here. Basically. And that's why we're here. Yeah, we're looking starting at over little, and yeah. Uh, yeah. Fresh you know, step looking forward and building. Yeah. And it's a new beginning. What doesn't kill you makes you stronger. That's what my mom <laughs> says. How do you think Alice will react to a new dog? She has been the focus of my eye for that's or our eye for, yeah. Yeah. Uh, But she's a really sweet, sweet girl. They'll get used to each other for sure. When we're thinking about this puppy, what are we looking for? Kind of a guy's dog. You know, I'm looking for more of a, obviously, like bird dog or gun dog, I guess. So um, you're going to stick with the same kind of breed like Alice? Well, I'd like to. we were looking yeah. for something like that, yeah. yeah. So tell me the breed you're going to look at. Red Dobermans. Um, that's one of my uh, big, big preferences. I've wanted one for a long, long time. Um, I'm really interested in seeing like a spaniel sort of dog, like a Springer Spaniel. Yeah. They like to play and they have high energy or they can... They've got those eyes, <laughs> those beautiful eyes. So obviously you guys have done some research. We are going to be looking at uh, the wine rummer, beautiful dog. Um, I'm a little apprehensive about the wine and, rammer. And, yeah. Why? Why? Uh, well, just because uh, I've met them in the past and I find them to be a little kind of nervous. Yes. It'll be interesting. This is a good opportunity for us to be able to see different breeds Absolutely. as opposed to just focusing on one. No, I can't wait. I'm hoping that there's an instant connection and it's going to make yeah. the choices a lot easier. I love that you guys are excited about this. Oh. A new uh, journey for you guys, but also yeah. a new beginning. This is yeah. great. All right. Well, be on. All right. Away. Thank you very much. Let's, Let's go. go. Let's Let's go. go. Now first up, Mike and Kian will visit Leanne of Instar Registered to check out a litter of Weimaraners. Now these beautiful dogs were originally bred for hunting. They're protective, elegant, and athletic. My name is Leanne Mitchell. I've been breeding Weimaraners for over 20 years. My kennel is called Instar Weimaraners. I was really attracted to them because of their abilities. They're a very versatile breed. They're very clean in my house, and their energy level is awesome. I can do anything with them. Okay, hey, welcome and thanks for coming today. Nice to meet We've you. We've been looking forward to this. I'd like you to meet our girl Shadow. She's uh, beautiful. This is, Fantastic. Well, this is the mom of the dog. puppies. She's, four, She's years four years old. What made you fall in love with wine rammers? I was looking for a dog that could do everything. Yeah. I had a partner who wished to hunt and I yeah. wanted to do obedience. As I looked at all the breeds, this was the one that did She's everything. Nice. I love their coat. I think it's the most beautiful coat. They don't smell like other dogs do. They can dry in 20 minutes coming out of a lake. Well, we have yeah. a cottage, so that's fantastic. What's their personalities like? 
um, this is a dog that loves people. Yeah. If I try to sneak out of this room, she'll be behind me. Sarah, typically, do they get along well with other dogs, just as oh, yeah. they're maturing and stuff like that? They're, they're uh, very yeah. social. How do you find their disposition, generally? Well, for the first two years, you get a very active dog. So by the time they're two years old, you get this. Wow. You get a dog that's very yeah. tuned into you. They're very relaxed. That's so are you guys ready to see the puppies? Yes, absolutely. absolutely. <laughs> so, so excited. Hi, beautiful girl. You. Come on, baby. Yeah. Leanne was amazing. She was so cool. She knew Very everything. Like, Beautiful dog. Beautiful. I can't wait to see the rest of them, mind you. A lot more uh, chilled than what I expected. Oh, oh my, my god. god! Look at those puppies. They're beautiful. <laughs> Hello. Hi, beautiful. They are beautiful. These ones are eight weeks old. They're beautiful. They were born September 30th. Oh, I'm so old. I'm so, so, so old. Look at that. Gorgeous. <laughs> oh, my goodness gracious. Do you want Look to come Look at all the cubby kisses. Hello there. Hi, Look at you. Oh, oh. They should bottle that smell. <laughs> it's unbelievable. My gosh. Hi, beautiful. Wow. Look at your little face. Look at his face. Look at you. As far as treats go, like, uh, what, what do you recommend as a good doggy treat? Um, we're just, uh, there's a lot of really good treats out yeah. there, but we ask you to avoid the ones that have food color in them. Are they barky? Here, pop, pop, pop. No, um, this breed is not given to pointless barking. They'll bark for a reason and then they, they recover. Come on, Can pop. we sit and play? Oh, yeah, get them down, yeah, absolutely. Come here, pop. There we are. Come on, pop, pop, puppies. Puppies, puppy, puppy. Look at the little girly girls. I love you, eh, already. Yeah, you seem like yeah. a really good match for these guys. Well, thank you very so much. much. Well, I don't know, this is going to be an awfully hard decision, you know? I mean, once bitten, twice shy, I guess. But uh, <laughs> we do have other puppies to see and places to go. But I kind uh, of almost don't want to. Me neither. <laughs> I think I'm sold right here. My gosh. Kisses. Oh, thank you. I love you, eh, already? Oof. We just saw the wine rammers. Yeah, yeah, they were very, very cool, it though. Was, Lots uh, of energy. I was pretty impressed. I, I have to admit, I learned a lot. I really liked that wine rammer. It was pretty nice. Very, I'm, very nice. I'm still looking forward to the Springer Spaniels. Sure it was great to meet with these guys today. I think they had a lot of fun with the dogs. I think they really connected. It feels like really good energy in the room, and I, I think they had a lot of fun. I hope that they picked uh, one of my dogs. They were such cuties. You know, I think Mike may have won over Kian on these adorable puppies. But stay tuned, because we're just getting started. Kian and Mike still have to see the gorgeous English Springer Spaniel and, of course, the Doberman Pinscher. Coming up on Pick a Puppy. Hey, Sleepy. Hey, Sleepy. Look at this one. Just sleeping while I'm holding him up. I think we found some new friends right here. Welcome back, everyone, to Pick a Puppy. Now, Kian and Mike are looking for the perfect active puppy to complete their family. And first, they saw a litter of beautiful Wamariner puppies. Now, we're one of these puppies, the brother or sister, for the six-year-old Pointer Alice. We won't know until they visit, of course, the English Springer Spaniel and the Doberman Pinscher. Now, up next, Mike and Kian will visit Nancy of Nanjay Permanent Registered and her litter of English Springer Spaniels. Now, these gorgeous dogs were bred for hunting, but make a great companion. They're friendly, easy to train, and super affectionate. I'm Nancy Footit. I'm from Caledon, Ontario, and my English Springer Spaniels, as you can see, there's one on my lap. They really love to be a member of the family. Wonderful with children, wonderful with adults. It doesn't matter what you're doing, whether you're sitting on the couch, out hiking, if you're doing it, they love to do it. Thanks for having us. Oh, I'm Thank so you. glad you made it. I see you already have uh, one of my charges on your lap. Yes, he's gorgeous. I love him. Everett is the puppy's grandfather. Oh, oh really? Wow. wow. This is a liver and white Springer. He's so calm and laid back and cool. One thing that's great about Springers, they're doing everything you like to do. Okay. So if you're going to lay out on the couch, they're laying on the couch. Oh, so yeah. They love to be involved. If you're up and out hiking, biking, anything you want to do, the dogs want to do it as long as they can be with you. Oh, wow. Excellent, oh, wow. excellent. I have a dog already, a German short hair pointer. Her name's Alice. I'm just wondering, what do you think? Do Springer Spaniels get along well with other dogs? Well, you Springers actually get along not just with other dogs, but even I have clients that have pot belly pigs. Oh, yeah. Really? Cockatoos. Wow. So very social Rabbits. Dog. I always recommend you know, anywhere from three to six years to wait in between getting your second dog. Yeah. Many people want to get dogs right away. Yeah. One of the problems is they forget they're going to have two old dogs at once. Yeah. And you lose two dogs at once is very heartbreaking. Yeah. So, so is there anyone else while you're here you'd like to see? Oh, I'd love to see the puppies. You want to see the puppies? Yeah. Come on. 
It was interesting to just with their temperament that what those dogs themselves could be. They could either be like a hunting dog Absolutely. or they could be more of like a show dog. Like a show dog, yeah. yeah. And here are our little babies. Oh, oh my god, god. Oh look at this. They are so, so cute. Beautiful. Hey, one each and one to share. Oh, hello, beautiful. Oh, I know. Oh my god. How old are these guys? They are six weeks today. Oh, they're oh, beautiful. My look at you, my guy. Gracious oh. me. Look See? In the same litter, we've had two colors, the liver and white Absolutely. and black and white. Oh, oh my God. Babies. Oh, thank you so much for bringing oh, the puppies in. They are fun, aren't oh, they? Oh, they're beautiful. Wow. What kind of grooming do they generally need? You can decide. Do you want the hair on the floor, on the couch? or in the brush. So yeah, I say once a week, grooming is important with these dogs. Well, just like we groom ourselves, you know? I mean, it's, it's, it's pretty true. much the same, absolutely. One thing you will notice, our dogs slowly will develop a few more freckles as they get older. Wow. And at this age, of course, they're quiet. Now this morning, they were busy running. And, oh. and you'll very often find a Springer <laughs> lying with her belly up, just in case yeah. there's a belly to a be belly rubbed. Rub, yeah. So cute. I want all of them. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, like, seriously. <laughs> well. So adorable, look at you, little guy. Can we play with them on the floor at all? Yes, yeah. please do. Yeah. Ooh, Maybe they'll wow. wake Excellent. up a bit. Wow. I found Nancy to be really super, super personable. So knowledgeable and, uh, you know, making us feel very, very comfortable with the puppies and with all the information she gave us. And her dogs are just stunning. Stunning, beautiful, beautiful. I loved them. Wow, these guys, look at, look so at small. Wind. I want to see them run around. Oh, look at these little oh, guys. Look, bite in my toe, are you? One of the things we have to start doing and teaching is called bite inhibition. She's just put her, ow! Yeah, oh, exactly. You right. need to sound, and see how that started? Yeah, absolutely. Wow. You need to sound like another puppy that was just hurt. The puppy thinks, gee, I, I can't put these human's mm -hmm. fingers in my mouth. Hey, sleepy. Hey, well, sleepy, look at this one. Just sleeping while I'm holding him up. I think we found some new friends right here, and I can't thank you enough for having us in today. Oh, well, we're glad to have had you, and if you ever have any questions about anything, don't hesitate to call. Thanks. Thank you so very much. Thank we you. really appreciate it. No, I don't want to let these little guys go. <laughs> okay. So at this point, uh, my Let's vote is too. definitely still the Springer Spaniel. Uh, I don't know if it's because my I had my heart set on it from the beginning. I found them very, very relaxed and very kind of docile, but, you know, which was quite refreshing, but I myself am a little bit too hyper for that, you know? <laughs> but uh, yeah, I, just, I guess uh, they, they kind of conform to you, she was saying, which is, you know, I mean, it's a nice possibility. Yeah. Well, I really enjoyed meeting the boys today. It was a fun visit. My dogs loved them, and I know that the puppies did. As well, they have their lovely six-year-old dog that they have to make sure that their puppy will be the right match for her. Okay, so they are so cute, such precious little faces. It is going to be a very tough decision for Mike and Kian. But first, they have to visit one more litter of puppies, and that's the Doberman Pinscher. Coming up on Pick a Puppy. Oh my God, oh, of course. Some puppy yes. love. How are you doing? Look at the way you guys look at their look at them. It's like, who are you? Welcome back, everyone, to Pick a Puppy. Now, so far in their search for a puppy, Kian and Mike have checked out the Weimariner and the English Springer Spaniel. Now, both dogs are very active and energetic and a perfect match for their six-year-old pointer, Alice. But we all know it's not over yet. They still have to visit Ian and Claudette's family of Doberman Pinschers. Now, these amazing dogs, they may look tough, but they're extremely family-orientated and lively companions. My name's Ian Brown. Um, I think it was by accident we became a dog breeder. So when we got 11, it was a big surprise. But I'm sure they're going to a good homes. They're like little horses, these. They love to run and, and fetch the ball and stuff. You need lots of room for them. Hi, guys. Thank you very much for having us into your home today. Most welcome. Thank you so much. This is Diamond. Wow. He's about a year and a half. Why is his coloring so different? Normally, I see them with more of a black coat and tan. Yeah. Not every time you get blue boys, but yeah. it's... One in a million uh, kind yeah, of things, like so that, you lucked yeah. out. Yeah. Wonderful. Yeah. How do you find the disposition of, of the Doberman, like, in general? 
They are highly energetic dogs, but at the same time, they are, can be very calm. Sure. You just gotta show them a lot of love. Yeah. Just on that note, do you find in general people kind of shy away from the Doberman because that kind of stereotypical kind of like mean looking dog or whatever? They do. You will get that. If you take them walking down the street, yeah. you will find that if someone is kind of walking along on, yeah, on the same the side, side, they will go to the other side. And the mere fact is because they've had like a stereotype, stereotype yeah, that yeah. generally they are guard dogs. Well, even in the army today yeah, in the United yeah. States, they're used as guard oh, dogs. Right, okay. But the ears clip, they look very fierce. Uh, yeah, and I noticed that he doesn't have his ears. No, That's right. Didn't we love the yeah. soft, yeah. gentle look of mm -hmm. the Dobermans. I'm all about that. Yeah, good so choice. We didn't, uh, we didn't bother. So how did you end up getting um, a litter? We got the boy and the girl, Doberman. One Good. fine day, uh, <laughs> they got together, and before you know it, mom was pregnant. There you go. Wow. So this was all a fluke, and uh, you guys are pretty happy with the outcome, obviously. Oh, you've got we're, to, we're ecstatic. A handful oh. of joy. Well, we have a dog. She's a German short hair pointer. We're just trying to find a companion for her. Do they get along well with other dogs? Yes. We, we also have a Yorkshire Terrier, oh, yeah. and uh, they, they were brought up together. You know? Wow, well, so, okay. Yeah. Would you mind maybe if we got a chance to see the puppies? Oh, Would you certainly. Mind? Oh, absolutely. excellent. That would be fantastic. Yeah, yeah. Excellent. Yeah, okay. it was neat seeing this sire. He was uh, a, a blue, blue dog. I've never seen one before. I was a little nervous at first, but once he calmed down, I was just like, wow. What a, what a, like, majestic, beautiful, beautiful dog. And they're dog. big dogs. Oh, oh, I oh, 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 Hi, big guy. Come on, have a seat. Oh, my gosh. Oh, of course. There's some puppy love. How are you doing? Look at the way you guys look at their look Hi. at that. It's like, who are you? Hi. Gorgeous. Oh, my gosh. I can't believe it. It's so beautiful. Let's take all of them. You wait now. <laughs> no, really. <laughs> Whoa. Wow. Wow. Hi, guys. You're such wow. pretty ladies. Oh, look at you. It's almost like a little mm -hmm. fawn. Mm -hmm. Do you have a big yard? We're in a condo, but we have a big ravine and everything. Yeah, else. and uh, lots like of doggy parks around. Lots, lots of lovely. Yeah, yeah. 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 We also have a cottage, so, so yeah, we, we have we a cottage. Summer long right there. there. In the summer. Yeah, lots of ponds and lots of like little yeah. ravines that they. I love their coloring. And this is considered the red dobe. Is yeah, that right? it's the red. Yeah. yeah. Do you think you're gonna have a hard time? Picking which one, if you do decide to pick oh, one. Oh, yeah, probably. Well, yes. <laughs> yeah. Do you mind if we get down and play with the dogs on the floor? Sure. Is that okay? A little Absolutely. Time? I'll bring the rest of the puppies. That'd be sure. great. Oh, that'd, that'd be awesome. Fantastic. That'd be really Excellent. good. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah, we just saw the dogs. Absolutely beautiful. I couldn't believe so, how so beautiful. cute yeah. they were. And they, 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 they were just Small. like, you know, yeah. and they were just so, like, looking at you. Wow, are they ever adorable? Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh my God. Oh no. <laughs> what do you think? I also think about those guys. I think she'd look at it and go, oh, oh, they know they know know. Know. oh, they know what they know. Yeah, of course. Well, I can't thank you enough for having us into your home today and introducing us to this beautiful, beautiful breed. Well, thank you very, very, very much. It's been, been a pleasure. It's been a pleasure to meet you guys. Wow, you're very, very fortunate, guys. Very, very fortunate. Thank you. Thank you. Absolutely. Thank you. You do. Come on. smell so puppy. They're beautiful dog, though. Yeah, yeah, they're very, very, very beautiful dogs. Makes the choice just a little bit harder, that's all. It'd be great if we could take one of each. But we can't. We'll have to make a decision. Those two guys that just came, they were great. They were full of energy. They love the puppies. You know, I'm really, really hoping that they're going to pick one of my puppies. Wow, what such beautiful puppies and so, so sweet. You know, it looks like this breed just might be the one that Kian and Mike have been looking for. What a hard choice they have ahead of them. We'll find out what puppy they picked and why after the break. Coming up on Pick a Puppy. Was it as hard as we thought it would be? Uh, a lot harder, actually, yeah. It was. It was a really hard decision. And I don't know if you remember, but we were saying that maybe she would find us and she I think us. she did. Welcome back everyone to Pick a Puppy. Now Kian and Mike have been looking for the perfect puppy to join their loving family. Now first they've seen three fantastic breeders and their puppies. First the athletic Weimaraner, then the energetic English Springer Spaniel, and finally the protective Doberman Pinscher. So which puppy did they choose? Let's find out. 
So here we are again. Hi. Hi. Nice to see you again. <laughs> so did you guys have a good time? Oh, we had Fantastic. a great time. Yeah. yeah. A, lot, a lot of fun. Met a lot of nice people. Yeah, yeah. So it was beyond your expectations. It was also. amazing. It was a really great experience. It was really, really good. Really informative as well. We yeah. learned a lot. To be able to sit and, and be with the pups and be with the adults as well. So where good. did we start? We saw the wine rammers first with oh, Leanne. Man. I was a little apprehensive initially about wine rammers and um, I learned a lot. Yeah, a lot more subdued, um, but I guess it just has to do with all the training. Mm -hmm. and uh, the attentiveness that you give the dog. And, and then uh, we saw the Springer Spaniels. The Springer Spaniels, beautiful, beautiful dog, and the yeah. puppies were just adorable. And that Nancy, was Nancy was amazing. Yeah, she was a yeah. really, really great host. And, and then we dobies. saw the dopes. Yeah. yeah, just as I suspected, they were beautiful dogs. Yeah. And the family was really, really sweet. I w especially was a little sort of cautious. They're Dobermans, and yeah, they're they're Dobermans of appearance, of, I guess. Of, they just proved how the dogs are a reflection of Absolutely. themselves, Absolutely. you know? They were so sweet. Was it as hard as we thought it would be? A lot harder, actually, yeah. It was. It was a really hard decision. And I don't yes. know if you remember, but yeah. we were saying that maybe she would find us, and she found us. I think us. she did. I really? really think she did, oh, yeah. So we're do I get to meet her? Yeah. I'm excited. Yeah, I'm excited. Okay, let me go get her and okay. get her right back. Okay. Excuse me. All right. All right, here we go. Oh. Here's beautiful Al. Here she is. Whoa, whoa. This is little Miss Josephine. Little this Miss is our girl. Yeah. Hello, Say hello Josephine. to the world. Aww. And this is the wine rammer. This was uh, by Leanne. Yeah. Yeah. And we are very, very, very proud parents. Oh, she is beautiful. She is, she's, eh? She's really oh quite so gorgeous. She's a good girl. Lots of energy on the norm. She's it's been a big beautiful. adjustment for her as well. And Alice has been very, very good with her. Yeah, she yeah, actually yeah. really, really nice. Yeah. She just kind of seemed to fit right in, you know, yeah. she came right in and it's kind of like a, another page to our family book, I guess. Look at those eyes, eh? Yeah, we're happy. We're very, very happy. So after your journey, what kind of advice would you give to other people that were deciding to looking at a puppy? Don't stay in the box. Like, don't just focus on one breed. Yeah. Go and see other breeds. Do your research. Find Absolutely. out everything so, so that you know Absolutely. before you decide, because you, you just never know. Honestly, like I said, this would have been the last puppy I would have ever thought we'd end up with. And before we go, do you want to maybe have a little puppy Josephine. hug? Josephine. How, yeah, how did you come up with the name, Josephine? It was actually my grandmother's name. Oh, you're a good girl. Oh, you're a good girl. You're a good oh girl. Well, should we go for a walk, you guys? Absolutely. Absolutely. Right. Thanks so much. Okay. Let's go. All right. Thanks everyone for watching another episode of Pick a Puppy. Special thanks to all our breeders and to Keenan and Mike for letting us come on this journey with them. To find out more about our show or how to be a part of it, visit us on cmt.ca or check us out on Facebook. We love your pictures and puppy stories, so keep them coming. Until next time, I'm Beverly Mahut. Hey, Bev. Hey, Bev, how are you doing? We just wanted to say hi. Thank you so much for uh, giving us this opportunity. And and, Bless uh, us with this little angel, and thanks to Leanne as well. Oh my gosh, it's been uh, a blessing in disguise, obviously, but uh, everything worked out in the wash, and, and we're all happy. So thanks very much again. Thanks so much.